out of the hands of our enemies might serve him without fear and holiness and in righteousness before him all the days of our life. And thou, and thou, and thou shalt shall be called the prophet of the highest, but thou shalt go before the face of the Lord to prepare his ways, to give knowledge and salvation unto his people by the remission of their sins. Yeah, nowhere in there does say anything about the other nations. Uh, <laughs> Yeah, exactly. We were under the first testament, okay? So we're under the second testament. Alright, the other nations were never under the first testament. Okay? The other, na other nations were never called by the Lord's name. What did I ask for? Is it? Is 17 17? This is Genesis 17 and 17. Then Abraham fell upon his face and laughed and said in his heart, Shall a child be born unto him that is an hundred years old? And shall Sarah that is ninety years old bear? And Abraham said unto the Mosai, Or that Ishmael might live before thee. And the Mosai said, Sarah thy wife shall bear thee a son indeed, and thou shalt call his name Isaac. Yes, Abraham didn't understand. The Lord corrected him. That's why he said, May he live before thee. What? And I will establish my covenant with him for an everlasting covenant. Yet again. And Mosai said, Sarah thy wife shall bear thee a son indeed. That's Isaac. What? And thou shalt call his name Isaac. No, and I will establish my covenant with him. So the covenant would establish with Isaac, not Ishmael. Huh? And, it's, and it says, but for an everlasting covenant and with his seed after him. So the Lord can't disannul. Because that's just, that don't make the Lord a liar. All right, the Lord said he's not a liar. He's not a man that he should lie. Yeah, and that's why huh? when you go to Romans the ninth chapter, Paul breaks it down, man. Who, who the adoption was for, who the covenant was for. All right. His brethren, you know, his kinsmen according to the flesh, which are Israelites, not Ishmaelites. Uh, uh, read the 20th, uh, 21st verse. Alright, um, it says, And I will establish my covenant with him for an everlasting covenant and with his seed after me. And as for Ishmael, I have heard thee. Behold, I have blessed him and will make him fruitful and will multiply him exceedingly. Yeah, that's the, uh, the, uh, the scripture that you would uh, read about. They read in the Bible and said that uh, Ishmael is going to be a uh, great people. Okay? They great. They got the oil going on, a big popping over there. Yeah. But they ain't the chosen. Come, yeah. They might got their women in uh, order. Yeah, they got sheiks and shit. Yep. Million, billion dollar uh, Maybachs and shit. Gold yeah. toilets. Yep. But they in bed with the devil. They oil rich, yeah. They yeah. oil rich, yep. Psalms yeah. 80, yeah. 82 and 6. It's in 21. Yeah. It says, 12 princes shall he beget, and I will make him a great nation. But my covenant will I establish with Isaac. So the covenant wasn't established with Ishmael. It was established with Isaac. Wow. And it was passed down to, uh, to Jacob. What? Which Sarah shall bear unto thee at this set time in the next year. It's amazing. Bible answer right there. Yeah. Huh. This is uh, Galatians 4 verse 4. Read this. No, that's a bad scripture. It says, But when the fullness of the time was come, God sent forth his son, made of a woman, made under the, under the law, to redeem them that were under the law that we might receive the, the adoptions of sons. Come so the ones that were under the law were the Israelites, okay? Yeah. We were adopted uh -huh. back back into being the Lord's people again because the scripture said that that uh, he was going to uh, go to a, uh, people that were called no people. The people that were called no people were the Israelites. I tell you that clearly in the book of Hosea. Mm -hmm. Israel was called no people. Discontinue uh, from our yeah, heritage. Yeah, come on, yeah, we did discontinue from our heritage, okay? So the Lord, the Lord adopted us back. Yeah, that's Esau. That's the uh, progenitor of the so-called white man. Esau. 
Alright, got a sign up, Jacob Iso. Jacob Iso sign. It says uh, Genesis 35 so far. The first came out red, all over like a hairy garment, and they call his name Esau. And, and after that, and after that came his brother out. His hand took hold on Esau's hill, and his name was called Jacob. And Isaac was three score years old when she bare them. And the boys grew, and Esau was a cunning hunter, a man of the field, and Jacob a plain man dwelling in tents. Yeah, when you look like a plain out here, it means uh, perfect. Complete. Cool. All right. Yeah, give me uh, 32 and 24, Genesis. Genesis 20, 32 and 24. It says, and Jacob was left alone, and there wrestled a man with him. The point is that the Israelites uh, had chosen, and the other nations aren't. Alright? What? It says, and Jacob was left alone, and there wrestled a man with him. And the scriptures say that, that we were the only ones that were called by the Lord's name. This, this, this is why, why we say that, because it's in the scriptures. We're about to read it. And Jacob was left alone, and there wrestled a man with him until the, the breaking of the day. And this, this, this man was an angel, actually an angel. Alright? And when he saw that he prevailed not against him, he, he touched the hollow of his thigh, and the hollow of Jacob's thigh was out of joint. And he wrestled with him, and said, let him let me go, for the, the day breaking. And he said, I will not let thee go, except thou bless me. And he said unto him, what is thy name? And he said, Jacob. So the blessing went on, went on to Jacob. Good. And he said, thy name shall be called no more Jacob, but Israel. Wait, for as a prince has thou power with the most high and with men and has prevailed. God, so what? The Israelites are called by the Lord's name, okay? The name that was given to us was Joshua Allah, okay? Which means he's a prince of the most high. He is the prince of God, all right? Is another word for envy is like jealousy or hatred. Like when they say envy, I heard you read earlier that the nation's going to envy us. Oh yeah, yeah, that's, yeah, that's, so it, that's like, and I think the scripture tell you what's worse than je envy. Like jealousy, envy is like uh, next, it's worse than um, jealousy. You envy somebody. It says, uh, uh, this is uh, Genesis 27 and 28. Therefore God gave thee of the dew of heaven. This is a blessing that was going to Jacob. Therefore God gave thee of the dew of heaven and the fatness of the earth, and plenty of corn and wine. Let, let people serve thee, and nations bow down to thee. Be Lord over thy brother.